So, hey guys, what's up? This is Natsu here. I am about to play The Evil Within. I say that and then I'm like five seconds in, I'm probably going to pee myself. Uh, no, that's not that's not true at all. Uh, I Word of uh, omission, I guess. I don't know. Just uh, kind of a, uh, just to explain, I did do a little preview. I, I watched the prologue. I watched Markiplier play it. So I do kind of know what's going to happen in the prologue. So I don't know if I'll actually be scared at the beginning. Like a lot of you are going to be like, oh, dude, the bigger. No, I've seen it. So uh, that's the sadness. I'm having to operate off of two computers. And, um, <laughs> and my, uh, my HD camera. So that's going to be interesting. I've got the camera here. This mic is going through this computer so I can actually do the Audacity recording so that I don't sound like crap over this uh, gameplay. And then I'm recording through my other laptop, so wow, this is just a joyous occasion where every one of my devices is being used. And so that you guys can see me clearly, I had to put up uh, lighting. I'm not going to be playing in this in the dark, and obviously, as you can see, I'm not wearing headphones because I'm a pussy. And that's how we're going to play this game. Yeah. Uh, from what I understand, this game is really fun and interesting. Again, I've only seen the prologue, so I don't know a lot. Pretty sure there's going to be lots of chances for me to act like a complete coward and a wuss and cry like a little baby for you all to laugh at and enjoy. So, um, to everybody that uh, pushed on the show on Monday when we did our live show and was like, Oh my god, yes, you play that. I want to see you cry. Okay. I'm doing that now. Uh, so, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Um, I'm going to go a little higher than this because I like to be able to see. <laughs> Survival or casual? See, I know that I probably want... I mean, there's a part of me that wants to play on casual, but screw it. I don't, I don't generally like to play horror games or survival horror on hardcore mode. Screw that. Screw all of that noise. And so uh, I may be breaking this into little sections and segments and then moving on from there. On The Last of Us. I uh, just want to point out, that's like one of my favorite zombie games of all time. If you have not played The Last of Us, shame on you. Get a PlayStation if you haven't and play that. Uh-oh. 5 0 one copy, code 3, ETA 3 minutes. Talk like I'm living in a hood again. No, I'm in a freaking hood. That's a lot of people from one cop car. Sorry, detectives. I know you're just coming off a case, but I'm afraid. Wait, are there subtitles on this? Uh, apparently not. Sounds serious. Oh, Is it okay? How how the hell do you get into the menu? Do I have to wait till cutscenes are over? Homicides. I'm sorry I'm talking through the cutscenes, but yeah, that's that's kind of how it's gonna happen at the beginning because I know what's going on. I hope I won't be like super super quiet throughout this entire game of trying to like concentrate and focus and play on the game. But I will talk over cutscenes that I've already seen. Joseph, look at that manly beard. It's a possibility. If I go three days, I can have that. Not completely. What's really interesting, and nobody tells you this, and uh, if any teenagers who preview as and like haven't really started growing facial hair are um, watching, God only knows why you would, but um, uh, one of the things that no one ever told me when it came to actually growing facial hair is that uh, if you've got, if you've ever had scars on your face, or like you've, um, uh, I, I don't know. Your your beard can have bald spots. I didn't even know a beard could a beard could have bald spots. A beard can have bald spots as well, apparently. Um, I'm sure. But no, I, I had no clue that a beard could get bald spots. And so on top of going bald up here, and I I, I recently shaved this. I shaved this all last night because it was getting a little long, and you could tell I was balding and thinning out the hair. Now you can't really tell, and I look like Uncle Fester. But, uh, you know what? Uh, screw it. I'm just gonna keep this off, and everybody can laugh at my shiny bald head. Um, <laughs> but no, I did not know that a beard could have bald spots, and I've got, like, a patch right here that doesn't grow any hair, and I've got, like, parts, like, I, parts that just won't grow. It's not, it's not like I've got scar tissue damage or anything, uh, too much on my face. But I, I remember I've damaged my chin several times as a youth, and now I can't grow hair right here at the very front of the chin. I grow no fuzz there. It's very weird. Okay. Dude, 
that's a seriously hot police chick. Like, do they hire based on looks or something? Oh, I love the rain effects that are going on here. I bet it'd probably look for uh, even better. I'm playing this on PS3 or not PS3. Wow, I've been playing the PS3 lately, so that's probably probably why it's stuck in my head. Um, but uh, I'm playing this on 360. I I would have liked to have played it on a newer generation console, but sadly I'd be broke and cannot afford that. Rain is gonna wash away any evidence. Yeah. There, wait. Why would there be evidence out here? I thought it was in the scary place that all the evidence would be. Okay, this is supposed to be a hospital. Why does it look like a church? Like, that's too much. Here's the church. Okay, wait, wait. Here's the church. Here's the steeple. Open the door, and oh my god, dead bodies. I have a feeling that's how it's gonna play out. Now, how does one sprint in this game? I need to know. Before doing anything, I need to... Okay, it's just not gonna let me do anything. Okay, can I, can I, oh, there's the frickin' menu. Options. Give me my options. Yes, yes, uh, yes. No. Show subtitles. Life gauge, equip icon, auto partner, life gauge. Wow, you can play this multiplayer? Okay. Cool. So now that I have subtitles, and I can read what's going on. Ah, Uncle Fester. Hey, Uncle Fester. I need now a light bulb in my mouth, right? It smells like blood. It, oh, so it All smells right. kind of copperish and a little salty. Wait, have they been having fatty diets, or are these people like generally healthy eaters? Because that can determine the difference in the taste I can of blood. Be an extra set of eyes. We don't know what's happening here. You're a backup. You're a backup. Really? Why do you gotta leave the girl outside? For once, let the girl come inside and be awesome. Okay, so, dude, he is moving really, really effing slow, and this is annoying. Did you hear something? Now, uh, I did see what uh, Markiplier actually did, but he didn't really look around all that much. I don't know if it's going to let you look around. Oh, yeah, now it lets me move around some. Explore! I wish to explore. Let me, no, okay, fine. How does one sprint in this game? I do not understand. Like, a light jog. I get that. A light jog. I'm, excuse me, I'm just gonna step over your corpse. Okay. Thank you. But, like, one should be able to sprint in this game, I believe. Instead of this light jogging BS. What's behind the reception desk? Oh, pfft. No. Let me... No. Don't... Aw, oh, it made me go in there. I couldn't go... <sighs> Are you injured? What happened here? People died. Can't be real. You're right. It's a video game. Impossible. Ruvik. Is that a Russian name? Like I've got him. The security Who names their telephone. child Ruvik? That seems so very mean. Am I in control again? Oh no! No, they're making me walk slowly. I don't want to walk slowly. Uh. So there is nothing here but dead bodies. She. Okay, to be honest, it looks more like she's actually sleeping on the job than it does. Maybe, maybe she's faking it. Maybe she put blood all over herself or paint. Red paint. That's red paint, boys and girls. It's not real. She's just sleeping to scare, to make the monsters think that she's actually dead and then they won't harm her. That's what it is. So the only thing I can do is interact here. Man, I hate when they do that. Uh, let me do things. Let me break your game. I want to break your game. Uh, firearms don't really work that well against scary, scary monsters that move super fast. What yeah, the what the hell? It's zombie Ezio. Yeah. Look out, he's behind you, dude. Oh, so I could have skipped that. Oh, well. My commentary was riveting. It was totally worth it. I don't believe my own hype. I am the hype! <coughs> Rats. Bleeding. 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 
<coughs> it seems to be my bleeding. Holy crap! Like, I knew he was gonna show up, but that was still kind of, like, startling. That dude, he has one eye. And that guy has a knife in him. What? What are you doing? I cannot... Oh, wow! He's actually killing him right there. Like, I can hear his dying sounds. That's crazy. I'm very articulate today. I, I made a description. Look at me, English! Oh, dude! Chopped in half, chopped in half. Come on, get the knife, get the knife, get the knife. That's how one frees themselves. Come on. You're almost there. Oh, it's going to do it for me. Thank you. I appreciate the Ow. Does he have both of his eyes? Because it looked like he got stabbed in the eye with a pen. Looks like he still has both his eyes. Okay. So now what? How do, how does one crouch? Okay. Right bumper. Don't don't look at me. I shall sneak. Okay. Come on. Put it away. This is where I go. That scared the shit out of me. Yes. Leave. No, don't look around. Fucking leave. Leave. Okay, use the key. Leave, leave, leave. Now I know there's a tripwire up here that I can't avoid. Why are you not running? Why are you not running? Shh. That's the save function, right? Yes, checkpoint. Cool. Did it. Okay. Oh, crap. I can I can actually see the tripwire. How do I go around it? I don't want to touch it. I don't want to. Can I jump? Damn it. Shit, it makes you. No! Shit. Run, 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 run. Seriously, you can't run faster than that. Sprint, fucker! Sprint! Of course. Okay. Uh, no. No, thank you. No, thank you. Run! Run! I do not know how to run. I can't do run, run, run to do run, run. Oh, wow. I walked right into that. That was sad. <laughs> to do run, 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 to do run, run. Is that... Is that my body? How do I... How do I live? How does one even... Can I even... To slowly open a door, press repeatedly to kick it open. Okay. See, I'm learning things. Oh, yes. It's going to start me right back here. Doo, doo, doo. I cannot remember the name of this song. I know I've heard it several times. If you know the name, post it in the comments below. Yes. Because that's the important stuff. Yes, let's get chased by the big scary guy. And this time not run into the swirling blades of death. Shit. Okay. Come on. You could do it. You could do it. There we go. And now to get your leg cut because there's nothing we could do about that. <sighs> so I have to I have to run forward. Come on. Stop looking behind you and just open the dang thing. Yes, come on. Come on. You made it! And slide the slidey slide of doom! That is a lot of blood, sir. 
Whoa! Not that way. The very opposite of that way. <laughs> hey, I'm I'm happy. I made it on the first try. Yes, you are filled with human blood, and I bet it tastes awful. And you've got a cut on your leg. That is going to get an infection. Ugh. I need some antibiotics. Immediately. Ugh. So many potential diseases. Oh, okay, the other way. Wow, that limp is really hurting him. He's like, uh, uh, uh. It's the funniest walk ever. Like, the way you're walking, sir, is how most other game characters glitch. Yes. Be proud of yourself in your glitching ways. And it's okay, guys. Uh, I already know that I'm not safe. And I know that there's nothing I can explore over there, sadly. At least, I think, until one of you posts something in the comments about, No, you're stupid. You can totally explore over there. Like, awesome. Dude, this is the nastiest sewer water. Open cut, in blood, now in sewer water. This is just... He's gonna die before he can even get to the exit. Just from that alone. Like... The infection will kill him before the big scary monster can. Okay, that's a closed door. Can I go through it? I'm just curious. No. I cannot go through it. Wait, wait, wait. Unless I don't have to have an A button. I can go through it. Nice. What's in here? Can I heal myself with anything in here? No? Can I sit down and die? No? Damn it. No! Damn you, invisible ghost peoples! Closing doors on me! Though that is kind of safe if you're trying to hide from stuff. I hate that it does that. Stop it. Hello, Where's mister. Ooh. Old sewer note. Beside the locked gate at the far end of the sewer, there is a ladder which would take you to the old ward. If you could make it through there, you could find an elevator loading outside. Or elevator leading. Wow. My English is so good. Leading outside, you could be, you could, you would be the one who escaped. You might be the one who survived. R. R. So this guy was the zombie from Warm Bodies? Man, he stopped being a zombie. He got the girl only to end up in this hospital and torn apart by a chainsaw man. Oh, come on. Why not let me through? I want to go through that door. Okay, I'm getting a very Silent Hill kind of motif from here. Can I... Why is that lock all shiny? There's... There's just no... There's no way to open it. Well, why was the lock shiny? Is there a key I could have used? Is there a key around here somewhere? But, like, it's all locked up with barbed wire as well. So, what would that accomplish? Okay, I, I shall search around for a key, sir. Because I think there's a possibility of me retrieving a key if there is a key place. No. Of course I won't find a key. Climb, sir. I don't care if your leg is horribly mushed and almost broken. You shall climb the ladder. But it's not the ladder of success. If it's not the ladder of success, what is it? The ladder of doom? Everything is doom in this game, right? Ladder of doom, stairs of doom, hallway of doom, door of doom. I like door of doom. That sounds cool. Uh, that's just the lighting. Oh, no, it's not. I can pick it up. What is this? Oh, boiler room note. 1300 STEM system operation test begins. 1350. Success! Confirmation of brainwave synchronization. Losses minimal. Continuing, ex continuing experiment. Agent collects the data. Yeah, too far up. 1330. Anomaly occurs. Not within the subject. The stenographer claimed they weren't feeling well and then fell into a coma for reasons unknown. Doctor orders the stem system terminated. Why would... There's a stenographer? But this didn't take place in a courtroom. 
Okay. 1345. Staff begin complaining of nausea and falling unconscious one after another. Hi, Hank. That's him shaking himself in the background. Those who still move plan their escape from the hospital, but for unknown reasons are unable to. Though the stem system should have been deactivated, subjects maintain brainwave synchronization with the host. 1400. He. That man appeared. Oh no! Oh no, that man. Are they talking about zombie Ezio, or are they talking about Mr. Chainsaw Guy? Like, who is he? Which one is he? Press the button! I am super good at button pressing. Oh, God, I wish I could sprint. Yes, hi, Hank. Shaking yourself and making noises. Okay. Anything to collect in here before I go in the next room and zombie man, or chainsaw man appears? Of course not. That would just be too easy. Time to go hide myself in a locker. Because that's what it's all about. You never saw me at all. Ha 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 ha. I am the invincible. Hmm. Hiding. Shh. Everybody stay quiet. He doesn't know we're here. If you all just stay quiet, he won't find us. Dude, he just blew that door the hell away. He does not like doors. I'm not in there. I'm not in the locker. I'm not in the locker. Don't worry about it. Dude, dude, you... You seem to be rather stressed. I think he needs a Kit Kat bar. Apparently human meat is not serving to help him very much. Kit Kat bar. Chocolate. Go. You know, there's chocolate in the other room. There's chocolate in the other room. I'm telling you. If you just go to the other room. There's chocolate. You should totally go there. Yes. He heard about the chocolate. Okay. I think I'm sort of safe. I can't see where he's at right now from my screen, so I'm just kind of like waiting for him to come back to the front. So I can just figure out his pattern here. I know he has a pattern, but I don't know where the hell he is in that pattern. Okay, there he is. I see you. I see you, sir. Yes, I do. I see. Oh, you're over there. Oh shit. Okay. Whew. No, he's he's in another area. What the hell is he doing? <coughs> what are you doing, sir? This makes no sense to me. Okay. Apparently I am bad at all of this. What the hell is he doing? It looks like it looked like he was coming my way. Now what? What the frack are you doing, dude? Okay. Can't let him see me. 
No crap. Okay, I can hear it getting closer, so... Oh, crap, there he is. Shit. Running away, running away. I failed so hard. Yep, there we go. And death. Lots and lots of death. Wow, did I screw that up. Ugh. Screw you, mannequins. Okay, I did not know specifically what I was supposed to do there. I don't know where my hiding spot is. Man, he's so slow. Like going about his pattern. Don't turn around. Or you're going to see my heart breaking. You can't let him see me. Where'd he go? Okay. Hopefully he stays out there. Shit. Nope, he didn't. Oh shit, right behind me. No. Damn it. Okay, that was bad. <laughs> Holy shit. <sighs> I can't make it through this part, apparently. <laughs> Don't turn around. You can't let him see me. Should I just go straight through? Apparently the answer is yes. Oh shit, he did see me. Oh crap. Where was the damn door? I'm sitting around looking for the door. I know there's a door out of here. Where the fuck was it? Damn it. I grabbed the bottle. I don't know how to throw it. <laughs> I want to throw it. Distract him. Get out of here. <laughs> no. Okay. So I kind of made it through. You can't let him see me. Shit. 
Where is he? Oh shit, he's right there! How did he see me? That's bullshit! How the fuck did he see me? He's supposed to be coming through. Uh... So I told you guys I was gonna die a lot, cause Yeah. And again, telling me the easier ways to do it not gonna help right now, cause I'm not playing this live, sadly. <sighs> Search out loud sounds they hear. Yay. Okay. Let's make it through here. Can't let him see me. Okay. Ah, uh, how did he see me already? Run! Dude, run faster than that. Wrong way! Wrong way! Stop it! Damn it! Well, at least now I know where to go. <laughs> Fuck! Okay. Get too much in a hurry. Ah, uh, I don't know why. He's... Ah. Uh. Like, how did he see me? He should not have been able to see me there. Ah. Uh. Uh, I don't get it. Fracking, fracking, frack. Well, like, yes, I know this because you've said it multiple times. Okay. I'm just gonna let him pass. Just let him pass. Go to the side. Go to the side. Stay there. Okay. Quiet, quiet, quiet. He's not near me. He's not near me. Okay. Woo! Holy crap. Ah, oh, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn it, run. Run. Yes! Get over there! Come on! Don't fall! Don't fall! Wait, it went letterbox. Does that mean cutscene? No! 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 Yay! Cutscene! Cutscene! Holy crap! I can end part one there. Ah! Holy crap! Ah. With only 30 minutes! <laughs> Dear God. Everything's coming up, Krillin! And that makes me want to smoke, actually. Well, not the Krillin voice, just seeing him throw the cigarettes to the side. Oh, great! Now it starts, and I have no idea what's happening next. Oh, dear God. Alright, so, uh, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode.